everybody, Gutter Bird here. It's Tuesday again, so that means. <laughs> Good story, Slate. Talk. That's Jive Talk from now on. Nudity on Slick Paper. It means after a fucking <laughs> shitty month of movies and even the compilation of trailers, which ended up being bunk after the first fucking five minutes, right. we needed to treat ourselves before Koontz tomorrow. Yeah. We needed a Mark Gormley fucking special. Part one of two. Don't worry, part two won't be next week. It'll be just sometime in the future, but we are doing all Gormley's music videos. I'm sure they won't be worried at all. <laughs> well, I mean, I just don't want them to think it's next week because then I'll be like, ugh. That's too much Gormley at one right. time. This is going to be a lot of... Well, we're going to fucking find out, dude, because we got five Gormley videos today. Five Gormley videos. Five! So, yeah. With a Bundy five. So, should I just start this fucking goddamn Gormley thing off right fucking now? Sure thing. All right. Still haven't got that wireless or Bluetooth mouse. You uh, know. yeah. Ain't got that money on Patreon yet. <laughs> Hard to Don't do. be a fucking dick. Hard to do with six dollars a month. Stop being a fucking dick. The optimistic Phil Thomas Oh, Cat. God. Phil Thomas Cat. My good friend Tommy Robinetti right there. I guess I should also no, specify no, that I today waiting for him to come no, over to film this. No, 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 I keep turning it down. It keeps getting louder. But anyway, yeah, before I wait for him to come over today, I fucking fell down the rabbit hole of the Uncharted Zone. So there's going to be Uncharted Zone specials in the future. So I have been watching hours of Phil Thomas Cat. So who do you blame? Government? Religion? Scientists? It's probably really a kiss for all of it. Dude, he's got a pretty big dome. He looks like Brady. Is that right? Yeah. With his, well, his I've dome with his stash and shit, he almost got to go from like, you know, cars. Ming. Look, you know. Is Mark Gormley an Death only Ming? Ming? On the Uncharted Zone. On the Uncharted Zone. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, get prepared, Gorman. Oh, there we go with the stance. Yeah. And I love how these are Phil Cat Productions, Phil Thomas Cat Productions. Cat believed in them. Unlike the rest of them. Is he in a spaceship? He's in a spaceship. Yes, he is. Fuck, we're covering them. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Dude, wouldn't you love to be there right now watching Gorm? He's like... <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's the girl from the last bit, bro. Beside like an old 1950s fucking circuit board. Why is he in a painting? He's like dressed as unsexy as possible, Gormley. That'll get the ladies. There's chairs are hideous. <laughs> How can you be doing this for so goddamn long, PTK, and fucking still not get the green screen right? <laughs> And every time you say BTK, I think the fucking the B, killer. The BTK killer, yeah. No, not Dennis Raider. I Philip know. Thomas Cat Raider. <laughs> hey, so the The maze. maze, yeah. The maze, yeah. The goddamn music's overpowering his voice. Most uncharted zone music videos, the fucking well, music damn you powers fucking no neck cat. He does something. He's thinking we're ever to put him. He'll be a toilet bowl next. All we need is more transit trains. What's it say? Dude, we put way too much effort in our music videos back in the day. 
you know, going to your grandmother's basement, you splattering you. fake blood all over the place. You knew all we needed was a shitty green screen. And just put it wherever the fuck we wanted. Some dude with fucking new bands. Well, not even, not even. Gore We could have taken the bands, and we, the rap groups, and the metal bands, and the country bands, and the punk bands we did music videos for. <laughs> Yeah, do you know you're on camera right now? Could have just put them in front of a green screen and just put them wherever the fuck crap nonsense place we wanted them. Everybody's like, wait a minute, we paid all this money to see this? God damn it! Dude, I'd pay money to go see Gorm Lee in a drive-in. As long as there was another feature coming up, I wanted to see Gorm. That would be like the build up to whatever you want. No, dude. If I can, I'd want to see a Gormley concert at, at, on the drive in screen. I'd pay $5 to see that. That's $5 too much, everybody. He looked over at the camera and was like, All we need, what? Is Uncharted Zone. That's all I need today, because that's all I've been watching today. That's why you're fucking insane. Work my butt, my... Uh, yeah, you're yeah. back with glad to work my ass off all fucking day, come home and just sit there and fucking fall down the rabbit hole that is the Uncharted Zone. Don't worry, you still got a lot of ass left. Yeah. Is there workout machines behind it? <laughs> what the fuck is that? That's where they built Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> Okay, so I just realized something, right, dude? Before I started, before we started filming, I did say that this video is nine minutes long. Right. PTK didn't talk too long, so that means this song. Who was in the spaceship with him? The chick from that oh, other music video oh, that didn't even know she was in that music video. She downloaded as a new music video. Help! Help! He's going insane. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I was saying. This, remember before I, we started filming, PTK, never mind. PTK. PTK <laughs> <laughs> killer. Never mind. I was going to say, video. this song's long as fuck, that's, I'll that's, just say that. That's all you had to say. Because PTK didn't talk too long, remember how we talked about it being nine minutes long, right. and PTK talked for like 30 seconds, so. Well, if uh, this is Grimley's house, it's very nice. Grimley? 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 Random chick who doesn't know she's in Gormley videos. He's like, yep, <laughs> hell no. Ground control, the major Gormley. Do something, <laughs> Gormley! Just stop looking like a turtle. Even that old dude in Crazyville was fucking doing stuff with his goddamn bow and stuff. That's another Uncharted Zone video. Definitely check out the Uncharted Zone's YouTube page. They still upload fucking regularly. I subscribed to them today. You should too. You got a bug hanging or something? I love his facial expression. <laughs> so this song's nine minutes long. Gormley <laughs> standing there. What do you want me to do? T -t 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 Turn? Uh, oh, okay. You know, so DTK is all fucking creepily filming this. I mean, if he didn't take the side out, he'd. Take that out of the on it. Oh my god! And Nine minutes of this guitar riff. Okay, dude, um. Standing is it too late to end this Gormley special? Because this is too much Gormley already. It's too late now. You oh my god, it is too late. I avoided the Gormley videos when I fell down the Uncharted Zone because I, I wanted to watch them. God gave here. rock and roll to you. Gave rock and roll to you. Gave rock and roll to everyone. <laughs> but he's singing and nothing's fucking happening. <laughs> you just made a fucking joke on that. <laughs> Dude, get Gormley. I bet you any money Gormley can sing the fucking National Anthem better than a dumb bitch for. Ooh, motorhomes! 
What is this song about, dude? What was the name of this song? I forgot. Because this song, oh, all, I, all we yeah. need. What do you need? What is it? Because I can't understand a word you're fucking gormling at me. He was he was at those motorhomes you saw the Winnebago man going fucking flies. <laughs> <laughs> Based on the request line, talk on the street, and use the artist survey. Okay. Uh, thank you. So, yeah. this gormling my ass up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna go. <laughs> so anyway, number two, or, number two is oh my god, the cries in our eyes. I want to take a number two on these videos. <laughs> the cries in our eyes. And of course, PTK in the beginning. Of course. I hope it's a love Thomas Cattier. Tommy Chong. Tommy Robinetti. Have we raised our DEFCON level or something? Well, we've got a new Mark Gormley video. Beep, beep. Uh, the Mark Gormley alert. For this one. <laughs> Mark Gormley is in your neighborhood. <laughs> Everyone keep a close watch out for a turtleneck <laughs> fucking douchebag. Uh, uh, hey, 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 call turtleneck all you want, but... I'll call him. Sorry, I'll take it back. He's not here. I mean, call me Rich Rigidelli or whatever. Call him. I don't know. Call no neck there, cats. No, I like Phil. PTK. PTK. The PTK killer. The PTK pussy killer. It's more expecting this international fame that you're getting. Do you think it'll change your life? Oh, no. I just, uh, I needed to learn how to play the guitar again. <laughs> Try to sing a little bit. Um, so I guess this is a little clip of what we're going to see as our last video of today to, uh, is the interview with Gormley, yeah. Just do what I'm doing now. You know, Dude, he looks like fucking Stapler, away. Stephen Root yeah, from fucking Office Space. Yeah. Yeah. My Stapler. <laughs> from that fucking angle. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> he lost all the way to all of the offers thus far. So what we did, we put together a music video that is kind of a, what could have been This dude thing. is like, started losing his hair. Taking all these I'm just going to grow it out. And I'll so end up so looking like Mike Wire in size, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> it's what it is! <laughs> hey, holy crap, is that fucking... Potty drip it's that chick again, so she must be aware she might be in a gourd Oh, okay. Impress me, Gormley. <laughs> he hasn't already? Oh, he doesn't need to impress me. I was just saying. <laughs> that bulge in his blue jeans impresses me, though. Mm. <laughs> Back in some heat, are we, Gormley? He's gonna strike out with some fucking Antonio Banderas type shit from fucking... What Desperado. Was Desperado, man. That'd be so great if he was fucking wearing a mariachi outfit and shit. Yeah, well, yeah, dude. I don't care what anybody says. I left here that night and I found out about him and I listened to Antonio his shit. Banderas? Not him! God damn it! I'm talking about Gormley. I listened to that shit all the way over. Eyes, a silent memory, the days of Look at how happy he is! Uh, I love it. The wind, the pipe, you can do the snow, the days of the snow. I feel like I should be the middle of ages. He doesn't have a bad voice at all. Uh -huh. I can't say, I don't know. Oh, this is awesome! I think I like this one better than without you. Dude, Gormley's teeth are fucked. They are coffee brown. <laughs> I changed my mind. I, probably, I think I would go to Gormley for a gun. Goddamn right! I'm to be the front row. I would pay to go to a Gormley concert. He gives us guys with no neck for a Look, Jeff Foxworthy from a distance there. Living in the past, how long do we last? It seems just you and me, living in a dream. Boy, his edge of his neck's mighty jagged. Like he bubbles. A life of the moment, can you show me more as we see the prize in our eyes? As we reach 
You know, he's probably in the studio singing this shit, and he wasn't quite thinking like, how would it look on camera if I did this? I don't think he cares, very dude, well. so I don't think he's going to do anything else. No, I don't know what's wrong. Like, he shouldn't have to do anything else. He's good at what he's doing. He's Gorp. He's Gorp. Bitterness, the one from the suicide kiss. Suicide kiss. Ruby from the skies. <laughs> Are you transfixed by that fucking oh, caterpillar on top of his lip? No, I, I was just... I, uh, I don't know. I'm at a loss for words. You're mesmerized by, by the gore. By the gore. <laughs> You're having the sound of the way right now. Realizing how much you love this guy and his no neck. And his fucking sultry voice. His fucking angel. Well, I don't think sultry is the word to describe his voice. voice that draws you in. So this is definitely better than the first one because it wasn't nine minutes fucking long. Ah, yeah, I don't The easy request line is now open and we're taking your calls. At 453 KATT. Request line. Hmm. <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> I think we oh. have to make a phone call. What would happen if you actually got Gray Days as the next one? But what would if I, what would happen if you would call it and ended up getting Hi, fucking PTK? Oh, I'm like, I know where you hit the body. <laughs> if you just be like, Hey, you get him in your neck folds. This, this is a PTK. How can I help you? And you'd be like, ah, uh, uh, well, we're filming a show right now that we're talking about you. Not flatteringly, so. Like you're built like a sea lion. Cats. You get the neck of one anyway. Stairway to stardom? Or stairway to stardom? <laughs> <laughs> stairway to heaven. But I know. He's got a little, little cur Superman curl going. I feel like they should have been in the movie Legend. <laughs> Tom Cruise running around. His fairy outfit. I just watched the Princess Bride the other day. Did you? Yeah. 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 This could fit that. Do you know why I watched that? Because I saw that, that documentary man, uh, Andre the Giant's coming up, which I'm curious to see. It's good. Dude, he picked Arnold up like he was a doll. He just held up there, like, oh, I see. He was like, ah. Oh. I would love to have been there to see that shit. My dude, a bigger guy just picked that big guy up and held him like a baby. You know, I do have problems sleeping. I think I'm gonna try sleeping the Gormley tonight. I'm gonna put really? Gormley on and I'm just gonna. <laughs> You're just gonna fall asleep to his fucking voice in his coke nails that he's using to strum his guitar. When the light begins to shine. I would have a smile on my face if I fell asleep tonight. I wish I could just my ringtone. I'm like, where's my my alarm? They're gonna wake me up in the morning. Oh, slowly, at least it would be all fucking jarring. Dude, his voice is as gentle as a pillow filled with fucking duck feathers. Looks <laughs> he got electrocuted. Like, what's up with his hair? <laughs> Why does he have a fucking bandaid on what you did to yourself, Gormley? You hurt yourself with your real job? His real job? Or do you have it's like a skin tag removed or something? Do you know what happened to that finer day? I do. Do you know what happened? Can we find our way? <laughs> the feeling we thought we had is lost. How long is this content song? I have no fucking clue, I didn't look. Well, you know, if I had a wireless mouse, I'd be able to fucking... Uh, guitar lessons by Gordon. Peaceful. <laughs> Like oh, I thought it was over. 
Yeah. 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 See, if it would have ended right there, it would have been perfect. I was all happy and content. And I was like, now you're just like, yeah, you're kind of dragging it. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, one, one verse, too many gorms. You're just tired of seeing this acid wash, too. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm content with seeing those. <laughs> I wish it could be a little bit, like, these songs would be a little bit more upbeat, like, without you. This is, I mean, like, if this is, like, if they played music videos at a dentist office. Yes, it's I'm tired of this shit. Come on, Gorm. End it already. What is it, like a four minute long song here? I'm tired of seeing your gut and crutch. Spinning round in clouds of gray, like a pet out of rhyme. Will we find that happier time? Peace, man. Say, Well, at least I guess I should say at least he's not in a fucking spaceship this time. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather, I'd rather be me? in a spaceship than to look at Santa Monica. We'll send him some other uh, planet. Dude, five minutes ago, you were saying you would go to a Gormley concert. I didn't say send him off into a star so he could explode. I mean, like, send him onto another planet so he could send to them shits. You know? <laughs> Book an alien full of Gormley lovers coming back. Top 10 at the Hot 25 page at the UnchartedZone.com. Okay, thanks for that. Thanks for that, Gormley. Can we take a break and have a cigarette and then come back? I mean, no. Nope. I feel like I need that before we continue. No. Nope. Sing me your song. And of course, PTK. <laughs> fucking Michael Ironside. <laughs> My good friend Tommy Robinetti there. What's Michael up, Ironside to be a sex with Tommy the, uh, <laughs> Cheetos giant in for yeah. the uh, for the music video to be in this Mark Gormley music video. And um went through them before the and video. And he looks like if he fucking changed his hair from blonde, he looked like fucking uh, yeah. like a hammer. Yeah, there's nothing left. Oh no, I don't want any. So we had to order another case from the company. That's like putting a tennis ball in your mouth. These things are incredible. You can just bite into them and eat on it. You know, two, three, four, five bites. Uh, Ten tens, huh? Oh, yeah. And now. Okay, Keto's talk. Thank you for that product the placement has there. Been waiting for. Here's Sing Me Your Song by the legendary Mark Gormley on the Uncharted Song. I've heard this song before. <laughs> Jesus! They're like, alright, let's crank that volume up right now, not expecting it. So they did send him. <laughs> what happened? What happened if I sent him off in his face? You were fucking calling it, man. I did, man. I didn't see the shirt. Lemons? Golden eggs? Yeah, golden eggs? Yeah, I was gonna say, yeah. Oh, so how did they keep that looter module fucking... Did, did, did Keto's go... Wait, what? Did Keto's goddamn fucking... Product placement this fucking ass. I think they did. She's walking down a beach with a bag of Cheetos. Oh, or does fucking down. PTK just want Cheetos that fucking much and he's like, hey, carry this bag of Cheetos. This fucking dude walked down a beach with a bag of Cheetos. Dude, dude, those are Cheetos. Those are Cheetos? Those are those big fucking Cheetos they were talking about. Oh, they're getting interested in me? I think so. Says so Gormley singing a song about Cheetos? I, I forgot what the name of this song was already. So what do you think is keeping that big going? Well, it has some... It has... The minute has gravity. Because the people weren't just like... They had to wear special boots they didn't fly off, right? I don't think so. 
And they had to wear special boots so they didn't die. You know, it didn't happen right now. So I felt that it's doing a lot to say. We can't do anything. So we can't do anything see, right. So and you're going to tell me that we actually landed people on a faraway planet. I know it's not a planet, it's a moon. But they were there and they were just hopping around and shit. So do you believe the Earth's flat too? No, I don't. But I, I highly doubt we did anything sophisticated like that. I think all the space missions are I all... Love you they're all <laughs> I look you completely different now. <laughs> they're all filmed in a studio. Just kidding. I don't actually believe that. <laughs> There's a lot of wasted money just to pretend to go somewhere. <laughs> Have Stanley Kubrick fucking film it. Right. Holy crap, Gorbley's not in front of the- Oh, never mind. He's back in the green screen again. So the sound of this song is awful. Yeah, yeah, it is awful. But it sounds like a song that should be sung in like a ironic placement. Like a Spongebob episode or something. So I'll talk your shirt, Gorms. Hit here in the emo girl. So was this before Gormley hit it big on YouTube? Because I wasn't even aware that Gormley was a YouTube sensation back in the day. I wasn't aware of him. Yeah. Never heard of the bastard until late. Yeah. Obviously a star power petered out. Well, then she knows, like, hey, hey put, put these in your music video. Well, we can't talk about everything first. <laughs> what? No, we, we can't discover everything. Uh, I don't give a shit if we do or not. I'm glad I find this stuff out afterwards. I mean, if that was the case, and a lot of things we did, somebody could be on her like, Snob did it! Snob did it! Somebody else Snob did it! Did it. <laughs> yeah. You know, or whatever, and be like, I don't give a fuck what he did, or what fucking nostalgia goose did it, or who the fuck did it. Well, we, don't really, we don't really touch the same movies that Nostalgia Critic does. Us and Snob, really. we do kind of fucking intersect here and there. But yeah, like Nostalgia Critic, he does anything from that dude for a minute. And the Nostalgia Critic? Yeah. And has he done anything? Yeah. Nothing interesting. I still watch him every once in a while. You know, no. <laughs> I still watch him if it's something that, like, interests me, but man. It's too much fucking skit in production in it now. Man. I enjoyed it when it was just him and fucking sitting in front of the wall, just, you know, joking around, just doing it before there was, like, you know, the explosions yeah. and fucking all the other shit. I did watch Snob, uh, not that long ago. Maybe he did. No, I still watch him weekly. Halloween 2 or something like that. I really enjoy what he does, those ones. Yeah, I still watch him weekly. I enjoy his shit a lot. Yeah, I like Snob. So now we go from talking about Gorm. Holly, <laughs> is he? He's like, looks like he's struggling to eat it. Product placement in my Gormly videos, dude. I think there won't be a second Gormly one. I'm fucking. I'm kind of out now. You're out. No. No. Let's at least go out. We'll come back to this. No, dude, we have one more video of the interview with Gormley. <laughs> You're right. watching The Uncharted Zone, the most important music television show along the Gulf Coast. Thanks for that. Yes. So, yes, our final fucking Gormley video is an interview feel, fucking now, video. How do you feel now about picking this to do, like, all Gormley? Huh? <laughs> so, how do you feel now about Hi, picking I'm all Michelle Gormley? Gormley and this is a UZ special. I'm glad we don't have to hear I'm another song. I'm songwriter Mark Gormley of UZ and how do you know? fame. How are you doing? Pretty good. Good, good. I know it's nice. So, Mark, let's talk about your music. Um, what year did you start writing songs and why? Seventy... Five and seventy six is when I started. Seventy six. My Damn. songs are come from there. It's about thirty years old. <laughs> what, 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 what video is this? I don't know. We missed this. <laughs> 
Does he have back problems that will like keep shifting his weight all the time? Okay, your songs and videos have taken off on the internet with thousands of views. So tell me what you think about that. <laughs> well, it's nice to know that Archie Bunker's well, daughter can do an interview. When I did this, I just did it for fun, you know, just something to do. Therapeutic, you know, just good stuff to do. And, uh, well, that's cool. He's, I like that. He said yeah. therapeutic, and I believe that shit. Anything you love, enjoy, enjoy doing or love doing, whatever is going through therapeutic. And more people should do it. Hey, your self titled CD has eight songs on it. Which of the eight songs would you say is your favorite and why? I love that album cover. It's the hardest to live. <laughs> it's just something. You know, it wants to go to Eden Park. It lasted this long, so. Uh, it proved itself to me, so that's what it is. But he's singing a song about locking that chick up. Dude, that's like the most energy he's had in a music video. He's just turning his head and fucking kind of <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it is like a rare disease that like if he moves quite fast or whatever, he'll just like... Bones will break like fucking Sam Jackson from Unbreakable. Yeah, there you go. Maybe. <laughs> I know that you weren't expecting this international fame that you're getting. Um, do you think it'll change your life? Oh no. I just uh, I needed to learn how to play the guitar again. <laughs> Try to sing a little bit. Um, I just did it for fun, you know. So for right now, I just want to. Uh, <laughs> you write about that fucking so office space thing, dude. Seriously, that way's like a deep, deeper. Deep. From that, from that, from that, from that side <laughs> angle with the glasses <laughs> and the hair. <laughs> Rush, and uh, seen James Taylor, but uh, I never did see Jimi Hendrix. With all the offers that's coming in, um, with everything that's going on, I knew on that dude was a Rush fan. Some of those things. Do you do you plan on accepting any of the the offers? Not now. Uh, I haven't done any serious playing in more than 20 years. So I need to get my calluses back and start playing the guitar again and learn, relearn all this music. So. Uh, if I do, it's just going to be in the future sometime. Okay, we're receiving thousands of emails and comments comparing you to the greats of Led Zeppelin, the Beatles, and, and well, let's like not that. go so that far. What do you think about that? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's cool and yeah, all, but just, that ain't <laughs> 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 just, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Right I don't see but chicks but trying to tear his panties off. Overwhelming, and I, I don't know. Well, you never well, know. You never know. You never know. You never know. Kind of Maybe you'll kind of like. He you might be the playboy of the Gulf Coast, man. Maybe. With this video, dude, we got all the fucking panties wet. Fuck yeah, dude! No, your panties wet. Fuck yeah! Right. I love this I fucking got video so much. I'm not in my gym, I'm not in my <laughs> um, are we watching this now? Are we? Is that what's happening? Is this happening now? <laughs> are you gonna cut back to Archie Bunker's fucking daughter? <laughs> Don't worry, I can't think of her real name either. But that's what she sounds like. Sally Struthers? Struthers. Yeah. Going over to Africa and eating all the food. Telling us to donate. plans for the future? Oh, well, I've got a couple more songs I want to do. Go back, work at the and, post uh, office, you know. Start looking for a significant other somewhere. Ah, uh, Gormley's looking for love. Yeah. No. Oh, somebody yeah. should give him some V. Okay, yeah. Now, attention ladies, he's looking for a significant other and he's going to tell us Well, what what's wrong with you there, Kmart oh, Sally Struthers? You know, uh, I think maybe he was throwing a hint out there. She's not picking the shits up. 
this the one who uh, looks like she has like blonde, blonde curly hair, hair and interviews people like myself. Uh, mm. Someone who digs a musician for sure, huh? Well, I they have to. Someone who likes to do lizard tongue once in a while. <laughs> I was waiting for Gordon like she has to like anal. <laughs> Whoa, mama. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> a little a little uh, a little shout out to uh, Joel Robinson. Turn into a whirlwind. <laughs> I want the footage. This is a strange place. To I want the footage of. I want the footage of fucking Gormley without the green with the green screen, but without the pictures. Things so I want to add my own shit in the background. <laughs> like what? I don't know. I don't know if I played Kenny or not. But when I was in the service, I played these places, and it was pretty fun. Now, I know you, you talked about that you recorded your CD back in the 70s. Uh, didn't I hear that you recorded it in, uh, what was it, in Scotland or somewhere? Well, most of the songs are from Scotland. And then in 86, I got a studio and recorded some of them. Uh, beginnings in uh, Without You. <laughs> That's crazy. Gormley wrote, like, re recorded these songs like 30 years ago, and in 2001, uh, the internet just fucking picks up on him and just fucking, for a short time, fucking goes nuts over Gormley. Yeah. And then I hear us late to the party as always. Right. What do you do all this? Do you have any plans to Always a day late and dollar short. Did he just eat a powder donut? Why is this look all wet? <laughs> Get my chops back. Got that coke in real quick before they went back on him. Oh, he is in fucking, he is in Florida. Do you have any um, advice for anybody out there that might want to get started in the music business? Believe in yourself, you know, if it's there, you know, these days just about anybody can, if you're good, you know, you just got to practice and really believe in what you're doing and if you want fame, then hope for the best. So, fame and money. Or if we have no talent, you know, just go streaking on live television and call attention to yourself. Or go on Dr. Phil and say, catch me outside, how about that? If Sorry. silence it's is true. a spoken word And your eyes could tell a story <laughs> the spirit is all inside Okay, um, yeah. We, we, we <laughs> just saw this. So, tell me, do you have any other favorite UC artists out there? I don't know why, but I, see, you know... And what was it, the East Blue Band? East Who? Blues? And, uh, I like that. So, yeah, Cruiserweight too, yeah. See, these are other Uncharted Zone fucking videos. This is what we have to look forward to someday. As you very well know, we've got to everything, the comments that's going on on YouTube and, and everywhere else on the internet. Would you Somebody like get a quarter and give it to her well, so she you. can have a rat and all that thing off her face. For my music, that, uh, that's what really matters. So, uh, thank you. <laughs> well, you're welcome, Gormley. You're thank fucking you. welcome. Yeah. Welcome enough that we did a whole fucking episode on you and going to do a part two sometime in the fucking future. All in all, I enjoyed that episode. And tomorrow, fucking coons. Yay. So this month that was fucking basically blah and Guardiana is now fucking basically over, thank fucking God. Right. So, on that note, we'll see you next week. Lola Peraza, everybody.
beautiful, beautiful. Uh, tell me, how long have you been dancing, Lola? Well, I started when I was two. I'm 13 now. It's 11 years. 11 years? Boy, she's right out of the cradle, huh? Do you, do you intend to uh, pursue this uh, career? Yes. It's a rough it's climb, you know. Stairway to starting <laughs> could be rough sometimes. Mm -hmm. All I got to say is uh, uh, lots of good luck, okay? Thank May you. I have a kiss? Okay, bye now. Lola <laughs> Prazo, everybody.